Holy shit, today's episode is actually fucking sponsored by nobody still. Fuck! What is up, you guys? It's your boy, Daddy Goose from Chris of Black Gaming. You guys are from Chris of Black Gaming. You decided to come on over and check out my solo music reaction channel. Thank you guys so much for checking out the channel today. Or if you guys from the web, you decided to click on this fucking kick ass thumbnail. Thank you guys so much for checking out the channel. Or, of course, if you guys are a subscriber and you're part of the 2.45 thousand god damn that's a lot thank you guys so much for checking out today's episode because today we are back with nothing more we've only done this band once on the channel before and it has been far too long since we've done them and from what i've heard their new album i think this is part of their new album i think i don't know but i heard it's an absolute fucking banger it's been highly recommended and uh i cannot fucking wait to get to today's suggestions for this band so without further ado Let's fucking get it. Nothing more if it doesn't hurt. I am really excited because I've heard the vibes for this is insane. I don't want to get my hopes up too high. I'm very excited. Let's get it. Holy shit, this is good. Holy fuck. This is... This isn't like heavy metal fucking bang your head off. This is just headbang as in like vibe fucking central. God, this is good. They, these are... These are vibes. This shoots me straight to the 2000s. I'm talking fucking three days grace. I'm talking, you know, three days grace. I'm talking, you know, three days... <laughs> But seriously, like Billy Talent, uh, like all those bands from the 2000s. This is fucking vibes. Holy shit, this is good. I'm going to rewind a little bit. This is awesome. <laughs> I, I was a little unsure about the start. I'm not going to lie. But this is, this is good. We all got vices, we all got choices to make It's hard to stay and hard to walk away One more pause, then we're going to ride it out to the end, I promise. This is, um, I'm surprised I haven't, I don't know if the band Nothing More in general is on the radio. No idea. I don't think they are, but very surprising. The reason I say this, this, like I say, it already reminds me of like 2000s rock, but very radio feely in the sense of like super fucking easy listening to like, what a vibe. Like there's nothing crazy about this. It is just so solid and like super smooth and and pleasant on oh, my fucking eardrums uh it's great uh let's finish it up let's ride out to the end and let's go little 
extra metal than usual too, like a bunch of 2000 rock. Fucking awesome. Holy shit. That was fucking awesome. God damn. That was really fucking good. That's the same band that sang Mr. MTV. What the fuck? <laughs> How? I don't know. But it that happened. Um, I don't know if you guys... I don't know how loud I have to speak for you guys to hear me when the music's playing. So I'm going to kind of re-mention that. Uh, one, his vocals, amazing. The range was fucking crazy. He was hitting high notes at good times, too. It didn't seem out of place. It was fucking perfect. Um, what I was saying also is it has that 2000s rock feel, but it has metal vibes to it, too, at some parts. And it's not, like, overwhelming metal. It's just sprinkled in there ever so nicely. And they did such a good job with this song. This is really good. Holy shit. Like, this is good, good. I don't think it fits in my metal playlists. Like, I'm talking, like, with Landmarks and Eminence. I don't think it fits in with that kind of genre. But like I said, you put this in with some 2000 stuff. Fucking banger. Oh, my. This is good. This is good. This is road trip worthy. Uh, wow. On the scale. Where do we put this? Here's the thing. I still find it hard to rate these kind of songs. They're just very solid, easy listening to songs because they're, they're not fucking insanely off the rails. So you can't give these kind of songs a 90. Typically, I give these songs a high 70s, but this song was really good and I will give it the exception and put this at about an 83. Very fucking good song. Like I said, this type of song usually doesn't make it in the 80s, if ever on the channel. Very good song. God damn. Uh... Damn, I want to listen to another new one, but I know you guys have lots of suggestions, so I'm probably going to go back and pick one of those. Uh, but leave some more comments for their new stuff, because if this is the direction they're going, holy shit, this is good, and I need to hear more. With that being said, let's move on to the next one. All right, up next we have Spirits, and wow, this was really hard to pick between the suggestions you've got left. you guys left. Uh, for this band, I was really close to picking a song with the feature of Shaddix. Uh, really close to picture, uh, picking that. God damn, I can't talk all of a sudden. Uh, but man, this band, after that last song, I can't wait for more of nothing more. I need more. I need more nothing more. You know what I'm saying? Uh, with that being said, apparently this one really shows off his vocals, which I'm really excited about because I feel like we just had a pretty good example of that. So if this shows it off equally or more than that... I'm going for something special here. Uh, so let's get it. Nothing more spirits. Also a year ago, so not too old actually. So fairly new still. Already good. First lyrics, already good. Like the vibe.
is good. This is good. A little hard for the first time around to keep along with the, the beat they got going. It's a little stop and go and stop. You know, it's, it's a little hard to keep track. I'm not going to lie. But I, I said the last one, and I, I don't remember exactly why I said it the first time listening to these guys. I probably said it then, too. The 2000s vibe is fucking immaculate here. It is so nostalgic. I feel right at home. Grab my fucking mug of hot cocoa and sit by the fire. This is fucking just, it's great. It's nostalgic. It's, it's awesome. They're doing a really good job. Like I said in the last one, too, it's that perfect rock sound with a little sprinkle dash of metal. I've been sleeping on nothing more is what I'm trying to say. This is so good. Let's keep going. Longer songs. I'm going to try to pause not as much. Let's keep going. It's so good. They executed it so good. Dude, I need t-shirts with this kind of design on. Those are really good drawings. Uh, wow. The, the epic riff that came out of nowhere into this slow part. Fucking awesome. I've been... What the heck? I've been sleeping on this band. Like, I remember liking the first two songs, but we listened to Mr. MTV, which to me was just too cheesy to keep listening to. But these two songs, what the fuck? They are so good. Let's keep going. This is, I don't know what, to, I'm writing out things to say because I feel like I just keep saying it's just so good. And I don't know what else to say other than that. So instead of just repeating myself more and more and getting my point really across, I'm just going to keep going. But holy fuck. I threw your hands on. Once again, so far does not feel like a 330 or like that we're in that long already. Blind by. Weeds in the garden, snakes in the soul. Every day passing, they grow, they grow. And they grow. The smoke in my lungs, the fire on my tongue. Spirits make me warm when my heart is not.
expected at the end there. Holy shit. I don't know what to say. That was... Let me put it this way. This reaction today went much better than I was expecting. Not thinking... I wasn't going into this thinking it was going to be bad. But I did not think it was going to go this well. You know what I'm saying? Like, it would be good, but not this good. It, crazy. Um, here's my hot take. I haven't done one of these in a while. So here's my hot take. It'll cover me for the rest of the month, hopefully. This song, especially the second half. Um, I got three bands for you. I'm going to mash them together. And then that those three have a baby together. And that makes nothing more. Billy Talent. I mean, that one was an obvious. I already said that already. But at the end, I got sprinkles of Avenge Sevenfold and Sleep Token. Am I right? Or am I right? Or am I completely fucking wrong? Probably wrong, because sometimes I just fucking talk shit. But seriously, those three bands make nothing more. In this song, anyway. I'm not saying, you know, like MTV... Even the last one, not really. But this song specifically gave me those three bands. Fucking awesome. Uh, I love the sound. Like I said, I, I said, I'm going to say it again. Rock, sprinkle with the perfect amount of metal. Really great balance. I mean, perfect balance. It is awesome. I, I'm going to react to nothing more. Like, more often. Because that was awesome. <laughs> I don't know where to put this on the scale. I've been trying to think if I liked it more or less than the last song. They're very different. This one's quite a bit longer. Ah, it's hard to rank. This is a hard rank today's episode. I, like, genuinely, I'm going to give the exact same. An 83. Like, on the... I, I Maybe a little higher. I think the more I listen to both these songs, they're going to go up in the scale anyway. But first time listening through, I, I, I haven't done that in a while. Ranked songs the exact same. But I can't decide if I like this more or less. So I'm going to put it 83. The same as the last one. Crazy songs today. I, I can't wait to do more of this band. Uh, with that being said. Let's move on to today's outro and recap. Nothing more was an experience today. I needed that sound. It has been a while since I've heard something that refreshing. And one of the best part about that sound. I, I don't know if you guys are going to agree with me. I mean, I listen to a bunch of genres. I mean, on the channel, we just started with rap. By the way, go check out my second rap video if you guys haven't checked that out. But on the channel, other than that, it's mostly metal. And I'm assuming most of you guys listen to metal as well. But for me, I love metal. Don't get me wrong. That's why I made the channel. But sometimes it is so refreshing hearing not metal. And sometimes that just means like your, your, you know, your average just radio pop music. It's not my favorite genre. Definitely. I, I could don't really care about it, but it is nice hearing just not metal once in a while. But this band, I'm getting started with this. With this band, nothing more. It's that perfect in-between of it's not metal. And it's obviously not pop. It's just this refreshing rock sound that's just like uplifting. It, it's just feel-good music. And that's why I really liked that sound today. It's not your typical metal. Um, it's a nice new sound. It's just really really good so hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode hope to see you guys down in the comments down below hopefully see you guys in future videos uh as well or past videos go take a look if you're new here at other reactions i've done uh with that being said though if you guys have made it this far into the video you know what time it is this is a secret outro word of the day which means when i say this word you comment it down below and i'll know what you're talking about you'll know what you're talking about you might confuse a few people uh but i will know that you watched all the way to the end of the outros, which is fucking amazing. Thank you guys so much. I really do appreciate it. Secret outro word of the day. Let's do charger. The word charger. You comment that down below, and I'll know you're a real one for watching all the way to the end of the outro, which, once again, thank you guys so much. On top of that, if you guys haven't checked it already, I've been posting some shorts for you guys. Uh, you could check them out or not. It's up to you, but I would appreciate it. If you guys took a look at those, if you do, leave a comment and I'll know that you're watching those as well. Uh, with that being said, though, have a good night, everybody. Daddy Goose out. Oh, and make sure you guys hit that bell button because I'll be having some more polls up, hopefully, for you guys to vote on what's next. Anyways, have a good night, everybody. Daddy Goose out.